Here with Miami tennis head coach Ricardo Roses. So coach, we've got two home matches coming up this week, Marshall and Murray State. Um, this is the first weekend of the season that you guys have really been able to stay home all weekend. It seems like most times you're playing a match and then traveling or vice versa. Do you think that'll be helpful to your team to get to, you know, just stay home through the weekend and not have to worry about traveling? Um, yeah, it's always, it's always nice to be home. Uh, so definitely, yeah, that helped us. So we've been having a good week of preparation. Obviously, um, a lot of things uh, to learn, uh, especially in those critical moments of the match. So, yeah, I'm excited for this weekend. We're home, so I'm uh, ready to see these guys compete and uh, another two challenging matches. So, um, But uh, we've been practicing well, so we're ready for it. And we're getting about halfway through the non-conference schedule now. What are the things you'd kind of like to see as you move sort of from that non-conference portion of your schedule and get closer to starting conference play? Yeah, well, I think the main thing, and uh, um, and I think thinking about even some of the interviews and questions, I've been thinking one question you always ask after the matches that says, uh, uh, what didn't go so well or, or what do we need to get better? And I think... Uh, been thinking about that and I think it's more more than anything else what we need to do right in those moments so I think uh, uh, we're competing well so uh, we're just really focusing on our, on our shot selection our ability to stay tough in those moments and not try to create something more than we need to so I think they're understanding that and uh, so I'm excited to see that 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 they're gonna uh, in a tennis match, any kind of match, uh, things are going to go wrong. But it's what we need to do right in those moments that I think they're understanding. So I'm excited to see that uh, these coming matches. So that's something that we're really focusing on, what we need to do right in those moments of adversity. And Murray State and Marshall are probably rather comparable to the teams you'll see in MAC play. So are there any things you guys have sort of prepared for specifically with these matches in mind? Or has it just been coming at it with a general sort of mindset? Yeah, it's just general mindset. Like I say, I think more than anything else, no matter the opponent, I think with the group that we have, with the mix of, of our two seniors, our junior, and then the rest, all, all freshmen, I think more than anything else, we're figuring out how to play together as a team. I want to see from one to six, uh, all invested and doing the right things at the right time. So that's all that we're looking for because when conference comes here really soon, it's going to come down to that. We have to see a team that they're all invested, fighting for each other. And uh, obviously, yeah, there are some matches. It comes down to one, one match, last match. But at the end of the day, uh, the message to them is from one to six, everybody is very important. So the more we focus on doing the right thing at the right time, we're going to have a successful outcome. So that's kind of the message. We're preparing for that. So every match is different. So we're, we're, we're just taking one match at a time and continue to do those things that we know they have to. But in moments of adversity, sometimes uh, we let go a little bit. So they're doing better in that, understanding that. So um, I'm, I'm excited to see how they react to a little bit more adversity this coming two matches and continue to improve. Okay, Coach. Thank you. Thank you.